So I'm Jason Bean and I work at Hasbro and I'm excited to show you Play-Doh Touch and the Shape to Life studio. And here we've got uh, your typical scene that you might see when you're playing with Play-Doh. But what you don't normally see is this digital device right here. Play-Doh had turned 60 this year and for the last 60 years it's been empowering children of all ages to be able to shape anything that they can imagine. And now we can take those shapes and that imagination and bring it to life. Here's a character that I made earlier. Let's call him Spike. I'm going to put Spike on the Shape to Life Studios platform. I give him a couple of arms. Here we go. All right, so that's Spike, right? But what we see here on the digital device, this is this world of Play-Doh Touch. And we're going to open it up. We're going to start a new world. And we'll see here, it's kind of like, this is your own unique world. And we see these sparks flying in. Those are sparks of inspiration. And they're giving you a little bit of a peek on what can happen and how you can fill out this world. But it's going to be your own creative potential that's going to bring this world truly to life. You're going to bring shape and color to it. Now those sparks are drawn towards this can of Play-Doh here. Play-Doh compound. And when I touch that can, I've opened up a world. Here's a tutorial. We don't need to see that because I'm here. When we've opened up this can, I'm going to put the microphone down. And so here's Spike we created earlier. And here he is saying, ta-da, he's got his own voice now. And he's and he's a little ticklish, and he's celebrating, and he's happy to be alive, right? <laughs> and so now I'm dragging him around this world here, and he's walking and animating, and I can continue to grab more of those sparks of inspiration, because those are important. They open up those cans of Play-Doh compound, right? Now, it's not just about making friends, because I literally made that guy, and he's my new friend in this world. Let's see what happens when I touch on this can here. Each can that you encounter in this world of Play-Doh Touch is an opportunity to, opportunity to create more and drive you back towards playing physically with the Play-Doh compound. So I have this can. I'm going to take my character and instead of those being his legs, I imagine them now to be leaves of a petal. But you can make whatever you want, and that's really what this is, experience is all about. I'm going to go ahead and capture those. And you see now it also brings shape and color to your world. And the more that you create in this world, the more the world sort of rewards you for that. And now we see two characters because we found that special can. But the Shape to Life studio enhances the play even more. This Play-Doh playground is about exploring what's possible, but there are limitations to this world. Unless you have the Shape to Life studio, there's places, for example, that I can't quite get to. I would like to get up there, but I can't, I can only jump so high. But with the Shape to Life studio, I have special stampers, unlike any Play-Doh cutters that I've had before. And these stampers, for example, here's a balloon, we have a set of wings, a music note, a potion, a thundercloud here. They do different things. So I might wonder what happens if I used a balloon made from this stamper here and see if I can overcome this obstacle. So you see Spike is celebrating because he made something for him. And it's a balloon, and I'm going to drag this balloon on top of him, and it inflates him like a balloon. And now I can get to places that I never knew existed before. Here we go. But I can also 
Bring in new characters as well. Well, let's go here. I've just made a little pinball machine out of Spike. And I can play with him in there. Just found another character can, so now I have two characters. Well, let's get out of this pinball machine here. Is the app free? The app is free to download right now. The app is free to download right now in Google Play and in the um, iTunes Apple App Store. How much is the uh, the Shape to Life Studio? The Shape to Life Studio is thirty nine ninety nine right now. You can find it in select Apple stores worldwide. And um, is, the, is there actually sensors in that pad or should it just a pad? There are no sensors in that pad.